So I'm in charge of my own store where I have to stock the product on the shelves and maybe give my customers giant towers of coins. And now last time I asked if you wanted to see more of this game and you guys responded. So of course that means the first thing we have to do is buy ourselves some more product, which is why I love when customers buy so many different things. That'll be card, sir, 1909, the year my father was born. Get out of here. What do you got, buddy? 2261, my man. How much money do I need again for new things? Yeah, yeah, customers waiting, hang on. 400 bucks, oh, but then I can buy peanut butter. Sometimes I like to rub it all over myself and pretend I'm that little baby thing. Just pretend I didn't say anything. Whoa, lady, you're buying all sorts of stuff. And gave me exact change? What are you, why are you walking like that? It's the walk of someone confident in their buying ability. Hey, buddy, just for wearing those shorts, I'm sorry, doomed to hell, nothing I can do for you. Never mind, you bought two things of bread. I don't know why my shop has the ability to let me play God, but I'm with it. You only bought $3 worth of stuff, you're getting struck by lightning on your way home enjoy let's see are we running out of anything so far it's all good oh i'm out of milk add one of those to my cart so i don't forget did i just get triplets to enter my store all right as long as they buy three times the amount of stuff i guess that's fine otherwise i'd have to bring out the mace huh? all right triplet one whoa triplet two really did buy like three times the amount of stuff she didn't give me perfect change but that's fine there you go ma'am uh so you didn't buy as much as your sister did that's fine you paid with cards so i'll let it slide oh exact change thank you ma'am i'm just annoyed at this lady for giving me a $50 bill. So you've got the new uh, leaning tower a penny. Get out of here. Scram, loser. Lightning strike. Dude, these guys are running my shop bare. Shout out consumerism, I'm rich. Couldn't find cheese, huh? I think you found plenty, big man. Yeah. Can't just start bullying my customers. <laughs> Finish off the day, starting with 500 bucks. Ooh, eggs are down, but tea is up. All right, I've got 500 bones saved up. I think it's time to increase our store's product so many other things now that are all so expensive. Everything's so expensive. Maybe I can buy salt? The salt, yeah, there we go. It leaves me with like three bucks left, but that's fine. Hello, my new products. Oh, it's all broken. Come on, get in there. We got shelves to stock. I'm saving money by making sure I have no extra help. I also take this approach with my mental health. Either I successfully lock in or I end up clocking out. But following no order of FIFO here, just throw all those up there. Come on. Oh yeah, salt. Here you go. You can be on this shelf. How much do you sell for? 217. Make it two bucks. Any Whoa, you just drove through! Did what? How did you do that? Can I ride this guy's nope. car? Oh no. What is this? Alright, my shop's still a little uh empty but maybe after everyone buys some stuff i'll be able to get it going i also noticed that i can expand my store again at 750 and i'm actually able to hire a cashier as long as i reach store level 10. i'm halfway up to store level 8 so that'll probably happen in a couple days one thing of bread Bruh. really buddy buy more stuff you jerk that's why you're getting 80 pennies back a hundred dollar bill nah you know what doing it again oh but it was worth it stupid jerk I lost a store point for that. I didn't realize that actually happened. It's probably because I don't have the things that they're looking for. Hey, buddies, not my fault I'm broke, okay? It's your fault. Buy something so I can stock something, huh? Gonna find peanut butter. It's $40 to buy peanut butter. I didn't have it. Why is everyone mad at me? I didn't do anything wrong. Now, okay, what do we need? I'm out of cereal, I'm out of other junk. Here, I'll buy a whole thing of tea, all right? This is like $90. It's what you jerks want, huh? Everyone gonna be happy with that? What's the price on this? Nah, get 6 69 <laughs> Nice. Gonna find olive oil. Is that not olive oil? Oh, I feel my blood boiling. Look, it's like 90 bucks to buy all this junk. Here, you know what? Peanut butter. There. I'm gonna tell you what, I need one of everything. What's that come out? Yeah, 264. Huh? Someone come in here and give me 200 more dollars. Lady, can you please buy the tea? It, it's the most. Please. I'm begging. Go ahead and grab a tea. Nope. Oh, she walked right past it. She still bought a decent amount of things, so I forgive you, actually. Hey, so what happens if I, like, don't pay these bills? It's obviously, I mean, they got three days left. That's fine. But it's like, SEAL Team 6 come in and just shoot me in my eye even worse the irs okay i took the coffee out because it was 55 dollars. i'm still 20 bucks short because of shipping please let's go in go into the shop go into the shop you want to buy something you want to buy something so bad yes oh it worked peer pressure would you purchase two things of tea let's go big profit and they bought a thing of tea day finished i didn't end up with a lot of profit all right big purchase hear these jerks complain about me now see what i think about that dude there's so much peanut butter i love when things come in gigantic jars we have heard your complaints have more milk i need to set the prices for all of this stuff 566 on the oil 535 on the peanut butter rice is also 650 yo this stuff is like 
pricey. <laughs> nice. Maybe I should redesign my store too. Hang on. Here we go. Can do our shelves like, yo, why is there a door here? Where'd this come from? Here we go. All my stuff is in view. The door is easily accessible. And so is my computer. We are open. Get back here. Get back here and buy something. Quit walking like that. Quit. <laughs> yo, hold on. He's got to chill with it. Wait. <laughs> Hello? Customer? Can I? What's going on here? Why can't people check out? for some reason 20 minutes later okay i reset the day and i move my checkout counter can uh the forces it be not prevent people from buying stuff that would be nice there we go just that one guy wanted to ruin my whole day oh we also hit store level nine i'm so close to 10 couldn't find cereal too bad cry about it dude this guy is buying so much i'm already at like 90 bucks and so is this guy he bought so much this is a 38 dollar profit uh i do have like five goldfish for memory though i'm not gonna remember what i stock on the shelves like at all huh? however i think after all of these purchases i should have enough to purchase a whole restock of things look at this tower Hang on, I gotta move this stuff to the door. Find everything okay today, ma'am? Nope. Great! It's a secret to customer service. Don't give them time to respond truthfully. Bruh. Hang on, I'm aware there's a big queue. I was restocking everything, though, for your convenience. Everybody say thank you and give me a kiss on the cheek. God, everybody's buying so much. Dude, I'm gonna have to restock, like, daily. I just spent 200 bucks. Keep this in mind. I'm now at 213 again. Go me. Wow. All right, let's roll it through. Thank you for your patronage. Appreciate it. Love you. Oh my gosh. Dude, she just bought, like, 15 items. This is great. I'm, like, rich. Here, I can pay off my loan early. Oh, and I need to finish paying these. Whoops. All right, we'll finish out the day. We can start a new one. Craft tongue flowers at an all-time low. But that's fine. That lets me change the price. This cereal just went up over six bucks. My God. All right, I did like a little bit of a baby restock. I need like 600 bucks just flat out so I can buy all of my shelving back. Starting the day with a free 38 bucks though. Thanks, buddy. I think today I'm going to focus on trying to just crank out the rest of these bills and my rent. At least the one that's due tomorrow. Here we go. If I do this repayment too. I'm almost debt free. Do I get like points if I throw trash away? No? Is it just the boxes disappear? I don't know, I'm keeping them there. It's like having a big neon sign outside my building. Dude, wait. I have a great idea. I take out another giant loan. Huh? Now I'm rich. Here, I can pay off my last little bit of debt I had. Now, in the product section, I should be good to buy, like, one of everything. Oh, I can buy max 10 items at a time. All right, well, I'll buy the first nine and then the second nine. Like a golf course owner. Whoa, and I just hit store level 10. I believe that means I can buy a cashier. Get him, buddy. Look at this. It's just automatic. I'm free. Means I'm free to just stock the store now. Restock all my milk. Do a little egg restocking. And I'm looking at the order on the market. It goes cereal, and then it goes bread, and then flour. Here we go. Now I have a shelf full of every product, and the extras are just over there. These are some brutal numbers. What's up, the eggs and the flour, but olive oil's down? Man, at least we're making better profits on things. Let's go ahead and open the store. How you doing, buddy? You love your job? Yeah, you look like you've got immense happiness inside. I can tell. First customer of the new day where I officially have a, well, employee. I don't think he's as fast as me, but that's fine. I'm kind of the best cashier this world's ever seen. I can't hold that against him. I didn't realize how eco-conscious we were too. No plastic bags only paper whoa i can get a medium loan that's so much more money that very well might be worth it let's see where we end up after today because i can't help but notice that there's a product license that i can buy that's going to give me orange juice soda sodas more juice milk soda but i don't know if that's the soda that needs to be refrigerated or the soda that doesn't and i'll probably need another fridge anyways so it already comes with its own extra costs are we running out of anything oh yeah i'm out of dark roast coffee I'm running low on flour and pasta should probably pick up some more flour and basmati rice pick up some more water some more milk let's purchase all that there goes 176 bucks down the drain quick restock restock everyone must find what they need like oh yeah that guy just sniped a coffee from me while i was putting more back on the shelf dude hiring a cashier helps i'm literally profit maxing right now and whatever excess i have i just throw up on my other random shelf and so that works so it looks like i'm gonna need more peanut butter next more bread my cereals also running low i'm fine on salt <laughs> They sold half my coffee for just more of that, I guess. Starting to run a little low on cheese and eggs, too. And this Elo spaghetti. But some of you Valorant players need to start buying. There it is. I'm over a thousand dollars. Well done, buddy. You gotta fix the nerd neck you got going. What is that? Too many hours staring at the screen, man. I'm right there with you, though, buddy. Next day. 
Open. Spend 252 bucks on more things. Restocking, easy enough. Like I said, I've got my extra shelf. I don't have my extra fridge, but uh, that's probably enough shelf space in there. It'll be nice when I get access to this. It's just the storage. So I could start buying excess of everything if need be. And then I'd quite literally just be able to pull the, let me go check in the back. Although I kind of do wish customers would like ask me if I would be able to have like extra, but maybe they will once I get that storage. All right, day open. Everything's fully restocked along with a little excess. I've got three days left to pay this 37 bucks. I'll just pay it now. Pay my bills and rent. And now I'm really debating buying the second product license. You know, it's good, buy it. What are we rocking now? Soda, 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 milk in a six pack but that's shelf display for some reason okay yeah so this is all fridge stuff except for one i'm gonna need to buy a new fridge which is 375 bucks okay how about whenever i buy all of that i need 462 dollars to be able to set up this new everything couldn't find cola soda how'd you know i had it i just did that like today while you were in the store i ordered it how do you know milk six pack what do you mean i you know what here i guess i could let me purchase a milk six pack that's shelf stable what pricing am i putting on this 11 15 it's a seven dollar profit hopefully people start picking that up couldn't find orange juice again i just how do they know man also my flower price went up hey they're robbing me 660 jerks all right i started to run out of things so i did a little bit of a restock i'm still slightly concerned about the milk that's just sitting on a shelf but hey if it's what the people want who am i to complain and i uh, i didn't realize i purchased all the sodas too with this order whoops how much does it cost to buy that second fridge 375 Ooh, it's only 200 for the single though here looks like i can at least get the apple juice in which i think people just immediately tried to buy because i didn't have a price on it were they trying to get it for free Bruh. no they're getting it for the market price those jerks note to self don't stock the store when there's others in here all right i've got 500 bones just buy my new fridge why <laughs> why would you put the fridge on top of my rice you know dang well that's not structurally sound at all with my new fridge set up though i'm able to start stocking all these goodies dude there's just so much cola this is kind of nice i mean it doesn't sell for much but there's a crap ton of them so with my new fridge my new cola i think i'm ready for my next day what am i running low on spaghetti flour bread Bread, more milk. Day 14's done though. Made a decent little profit. Oh, and everything's up. Oh, I accidentally bought two things of bread. Dang it. All right, I wonder how today's gonna do. I'm at 73 dollars. You know what? Hang on. Let me pay my bills and my rent. Oh, I should pay the bank, but uh, don't have that much money. It's fine. I'm at 28 bucks. We can see how much profit I end up making today. We are open. Like I said, I've got 28 dollars. You know what? Let me write this down because I'll forget guaranteed. I have goldfish, remember? Hey, what are you two doing? Nah, nah, come here. Come here, get into my store. Get into my store, full box to 100. Now I can't lie, it's kind of nice having the cashier. I wish I had someone who would like stock boxes though, you know? Like if I had stuff in my storage, they would come out and put it on the shelf. So far, I mean, it's fine that I do it. I just, you know, I'm lazy, so. And well, we've been open for four hours. I've already got 165 bucks. Feeling like we're doing good, let's repay part of this loan. Dude, look at how many product licenses there are too. We can sell so much. Maybe it is about to be time to buy the storage. I mean, that looks like it's a whole little room in there. It's also only 800 bucks. Huh? How's this stuff selling too? Looks somewhat decent. I'm also just realizing I'm paying this guy $80 to work a 13 hour shift. Minimum wage here's gotta be like seven bucks. That means this guy works for 45 minutes and he can have one box of spaghetti pasta. Hang on, what are, what are my profit margins on the spaghetti pasta? For every box of pasta that gets sold, I make 30 minutes of this guy's life. <laughs> Isn't capitalism awesome? Go ahead and keep bagging up these drinks, buddy. You got it. You are now one of my elite employees, friend. So I am just running low on product. I'm out of oil. I'm about to be out of powdered sugar. Almost out of milk again. I'm running low on coffee and tea. Great news. Store level's going up. I don't think I'm big enough yet that I should start buying a second checkout station, but like this line's getting pretty big. I wonder if eventually I should have enough shelves where I fill all of like these two with cereal, these two with milk, these two with flour. It's like doubling the amount of product that I can hold. The checkouts are full. Stand around. Buy something. And our final customer is checked out, meaning I made 687 bucks today, according to my calculator. That's pretty dang good. Maybe it is time to expand our store a little bit more. But that can wait till next time. For now, thank you so much for watching. As always, if you want to see more of this game, leave me a link in the description down below as well as any suggestions you have so I can run my store better. And until then, I'll see you.